In this video, I'll demonstrate how to miter perfect 90 degree corners with a radial arm saw. Making four sided frames generally requires cutting perfect right and left hand 45 degree miters. When using a radial arm saw, you might be tempted to swing the arm from one side to the other to cut the right and left miters. However, moving the arm to two positions potentially increases the error in miter accuracy. A better way is to use a technique known as the broken fence method. With this technique, the arm is set to 45 degrees and all of the right hand miters are first cut using an auxiliary fence. Next, Without moving the arm, the normal fence is installed to cut the left hand miters. Even if the arm is not set to exactly 45 degrees, you will still end up with a perfect 90 degree corner because the angles will be complementary to each other. To start, I cut a piece of 3 quarter inch plywood as deep as the table and wide enough to clear my dust collection box. An extra piece of half inch plywood is glued on top to create a taller fence. Holes are countersunk along the back edge so the board can be attached to a cleat. The cleat is cut to be the same height as the main table. This metal rule sticks up a little higher than the cleat and will be used to adjust the fence. This is the most important step. It's critical that the auxiliary fence is mounted perpendicular or 90 degrees to where the fence is normally located. Verify ahead of time that your carpenter's square is truly square. With the table securely clamped in place, it can now be permanently screwed to the cleat. Once made, the auxiliary fence can be quickly installed square whenever it's needed. Installed to clear my dust collection box, a small corner needs to be removed. Here's an example of cutting picture frames using the broken fence method. First I mark the rough locations where all of the miter cuts will be made. All of the right hand miters are first cut against the auxiliary fence. After the auxiliary fence is removed, a standard fence is installed. This fence is extended on the right side which makes it convenient to attach a stop block 
and allows me to cut pieces up to one meter or 36 inches in length. My stop block has a recess so it doesn't damage the sharp point of the miter. The stop block is set so the pieces can be cut to final length when the left hand miters are made. And that's how you use the broken fence method to make perfect mitered 90 degree corners with a radial arm saw.